thank you so much uh, today for this uh, momentous event because we believe that today i think uh, india is creating history because uh, of the fact that together we'll create this new category of programs which will signal academic brilliance academic excellence from the iits will signal uh, skill building from the nsdc's pedestal and it will also signal employer connectivity that team leads and team leads tech brings on table um, i think we are all creating an alternative pathway for our learners today to make their careers out of today uh, i am I'm, i'm really excited about this particular journey what what do you do be your opinion with this so thank you shantanu and uh, i think uh, education system in india has over last two years seen momentous changes yeah nep is driving lot of these yeah. yeah and many times you have policies but the great vision that our prime minister the honorable prime minister had that when mr pradhan took over as both minister of education minister for skill development yeah, yeah. Um, over last two years we have seen the regulators like ugc aict ncbt all coming together hmm. and a national credit framework is a unique uh, framework which brings lifelong learning into a life through that uh, platform because it allows any individual or rather empowers individuals to accrue credits yeah through their academic path or through the skill paths or while they are at workplace yeah, yeah. so there are three dimensions of national credit framework where people can accrue credit and then they can redeem for uh, educational degree programs etc so this program is unique that actually it is uh, the design is such that that is bringing the education from iit and the skills from nsdc and the employability from team these together and i see a uh, clearly four dimensions many individuals who are already at the workplace they want they believe that they need to reskill upskill themselves program offers a range of certificate diploma degree post grad opportunities to them many a corporates can actually take a leap of faith and they can find that this is an alternative way of to build their talent pipeline mm. so mm. students who are just out of 12th they can uh, uh, join these work embedded degree programs then there are educational institution the iit brand is known all over the world how do we make the iit brand available to the educational institutions the tier 2 tier 3 Uh, education institutions in this country, yeah, and that's where that. a leap of faith that the IIT Patna has taken, that this can actually be become a uh, embedded uh, or dual degree programs for many education institutions in this country. Many students in those education institutions may decide that they will make an extra effort and uh, take advantage of this. So, from all these perspectives, I see that this is a, a wonderful uh, opportunity, and I'll request. actually the corporates to come forward because their sponsorship to this will bring the true strength to the program we while three of us are here and we will commit our best but uh, through this uh, conversation i want to reach out to the uh, employers and the uh, big innovators in this country that if india has to become a vikasit bharat probably uh, programs like this will play a great role in that absolutely absolutely uh, how do you see this sir from your perspective it is a unique uh, opportunity for us to work with the nsdc first because they are the you can say the central point or pivotal point from where this uh, skill development work will be taken care of our education minister all the times he stress that the education for all and i think this is the one way that those who had lost the line by few centimeter but they have the equal credential and credibility they can also join this course those who have joined the job and they want to up skill as dr tiwari said they can have the opportunity so by this uh, method we can say that what is this nep main motto that the education should be acceptable affordable accessible to all and once we are going in this that we are giving equal opportunity to all and let them fight and compete with those who have come through the jee or those who have not come to jee but ultimately what matters how much you have learned how much you have been capable to deliver that will be the at the end will be the acceptable 
across the world not only in the india and india has the great workforce and i think uh, we have the right opportunity to uh, train our people to not serve in india across the world also. we are, we are also very excited about this sir because uh, we believe that the concept of mm-hmm. earn while you learn and learning by doing uh, are are a very unique ways to ensure that a lot of people who remain deprived of high quality employable education can now be uh, now can be brought into this framework ensuring that this this true inclusive growth and with uh, iit patnas guidance and with the umbrella being available i think we can actually bring in a new dimension new pedagogy of learning yeah you see the education is always a process of learning something which is unique adventurous also uh, it should beyond the book also learning is very very intensely important and i think this kind of the course will give us out of the book what one should learn and uh, digest and then deliver so that that will be i think important because the course structure in all iits and other university that is sometimes quite old not up to the mark but here it will be the just like a dynamic system so whatever the industry need accordingly you can frame out this uh, uh, course content and teach them and let them enjoy with this and learn and deliver that will be the important that delivery system and that's why what dr tiwari said about the corporate should come out so corporate should come out uh, with a certain kind of this uh, limitation they have they cannot up skill they cannot upgrade then those people can come and get refresh here and have a new idea and they can go with this very enthusiastic way uh, to work uh, with a great passion uh, not only because they got the job and they have to uh, do some I, I think I, we are really excited because this this is uh, we believe this is true industry academy of knowledge, which actually impacts the le- the learner directly through participation courses, curriculum, content, teaching, pedagogy, financing, and ultimately uh, employability. I think all of this put together makes this program unique. Thanks to both of you for for partnering yeah, with me. Yeah, before TV. that uh, you can go. I can only say uh, that uh, this program will take up to our board chairman. Yeah. get his approval and consent then you can proceed yeah yeah absolutely i would like to add here that we are truly fortunate that we have uh, blessings of our prime minister who was who has he was actually always ahead of time uh, when uh, skill india mission was launched that time he dreamt that india will be the skill capital of the world and ep 2020 which talked about uh, skill and education coming together was work in place even before the covid happened post covid the whole world has started talking about the skill based hiring and things like that our prime minister envisioned that much before that and the very fact that the director of iit uh, i from nsdc and you from uh, team these we are on the same table and we are discussing about what a, a unique way of skill based education for working professional in this country is a is an a proof in itself that probably this kind of a uh, thing is very difficult that uh, that we have seen earlier yeah. so uh, we are fortunate and i uh, believe that uh, next dialogue will happen with few uh, corporates also on the table yes yeah. and uh, then we'll be able to take the true message forward that india will become viksit bharat and the uh, route to that will go from excellence and uh, the temple of excellence that id patna is here we are all uh, fortunate to have uh, the director id patna uh, going f- uh, forward and taking this kind of a opportunity thank you so much thank you